Hello everyone, I just wanted to put out a quick guide to uh, what I've been doing to collect uh, plunder skulls. Um, I find this uh, method is quite fast. Usually I can get a skull about every minute to a minute 15. Um, this method will work with all classes. Um, so you'll go to Fungal Grotto 1. Um, preferably the way I do it, it's more for Nightblades. But it can be done with all classes. But what I'm going to show you is best done by a Nightblade. If you have someone with high DPS, you can do it pretty easily otherwise. But strictly the way I do it is pretty much for Nightblades to be lazy. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to have a friend log into a character. And basically log into an alt they don't use. So they can stay in your party. So you can reset your dungeons over and over and over and over again. So if you notice what I did is I stealth past the first two groups. So I could get to the first boss here. So what essentially I do is I sneak past the first two groups so I don't have to fight them at all. And I go right to the first boss here. And the idea behind this is just to kill the first boss and basically just leave the dungeon and then come back in and rinse and repeat. So, you know, usually I can do each run from what I've timed anywhere between a minute to a minute 15 seconds. See, so you, you see, um, you get the plundered skull there. So I go P, T, E. You go to the front of the dungeon. The reason why you're going to want to have a friend offline is so you can go to party again, switch from veteran to normal. I find some people say you can do that with out people in your party, but for some reason, uh, every time I try to do it by myself and no one in my party, it doesn't seem to work. And so as I mentioned, once again, if you're Nightblade, just stealth past the groups. And rinse and repeat. You just keep doing that over and over and over. So, one of the main reasons why you're going to want to do this is there is a house out um, during the Halloween event that requires you to get 100 plunder skulls. You know, this method I find is pretty good. You know, as I mentioned, you get, you know, a skull a minute to a minute 30, depending on your DPS. You know, if you're a high DPS class and, you know, you're pretty confident, you can pull both groups to the boss and just AOE it down. But personally, I just like to sneak past them, you know, so I don't have to deal with it. Alrighty, so that's that. So once again, you will go to Stone Falls, uh, the Temple Path right here. So Illith Temple Way Shrine, you'll come over here. Fungal Grow to 01, FG1 if you prefer. And then just run to the first boss, exit, rinse and repeat. I find that I've tried to do the whole dungeon, but the gap between the first boss and the second boss, it was more than a minute. When I timed it, it was about, you know, a minute 30 to two minutes. And then from that boss to the next boss, you know, is faster, but overall, in general time, it seems that it's quite fast just to go to the first boss, exit the dungeon, reset, and just keep repeating. Alrighty, well, have a great day, uh, happy Halloween, and thanks for watching.